Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina is to leave for New Year tomorrow to attend the 78th United Nations General Assembly. Road march of BNP has begun, which will end through the fall of the current government, says Mirza Fokshu. Six people, including children, were killed in a road crashes in North Indy in a span of four hours. Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to My TV English News. I'm Ashiku Zaman with you in the newsroom today. Watching the headlines. Now, the details. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina will leave here for New York, USA tomorrow to attend the 78th session of the United Nations General Assembly. A VVIP flight of Biman Bangladesh Airlines carrying the Premier and her entourage members will depart from Hazrat Shah Jalal International Airport at 9.45 a.m. The flight is scheduled to land at John F. Kennedy International Airport in New York at 10.50 p.m. New York time on September 17 after a four-hour stopover at the Heathrow International Airport in London. Bangladesh Ambassador and Permanent Representative to United Nations, Muhammad Abdul Muhid, and Bangladesh Ambassador to USA, Muhammad Imran, will receive the Prime Minister at the airport. During her stay in New York from September 17 to 22, the Premier will attend the first day of the high-level general debate of the 78th UNGA session at the General Assembly Hall of the United Nations headquarters on September 19, while she will address it on September 22 between 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. local time. Sheikh Hasina was also invited to join a dinner hosted by U.S. President Joe Biden on September 19 as well. After attending the events, she will leave New York for Washington, D.C. on September 23rd, where she will stay on 23rd to 29th September. She will leave Washington, D.C. for London on September 29. Prime Minister is expected to return home from London on October 4. BNP Secretary General Mirza Fokhrul Islam Alumgir claimed that their youth road march will end through the fall of the incumbent government. After inaugurating the pre-announced program Youth Road March at Grand Hotel intersection in front of BNP Strongpur office today, Fokrul said road march begins which will end through the fall of the current government. He said road march has been launched demanding the resignation of the government. BNP leaders and activists brought out the march on 11 a.m. from the district party office to press home their one-point demand, which includes the government's resignation. Awami League General Secretary and Road Transport and Bridges Minister Ubaidul Qadir left Dhaka on Saturday morning for Singapore for his routine health checkup. He left Dhaka on a Biman Bangladesh Airlines flight at 8.30 a.m. The Awami League leader has been suffering from chronic heart and lung problems for long. Six people, including children, were killed in a road crash in North Indy in a span of four hours. Meanwhile, three people, including father and son, were killed in a head-on collision between a truck and a motor bus at Shippur in the district on Friday at around 2 a.m. Seven others were injured in this accident. Just four hours before this accident, three more people were killed in a collision between a bus and an auto rickshaw in VT Morjal area of Raipura Upojila on Dhaka Silet Highway at around 10.30 p.m. Two other people, including the auto driver, were injured in this incident. A new militant outfit, Tawhid al-Uluhiyah al-Jihadi, 
has emerged in the country, which has been operating its activities from two to three months. The anti-terrorism unit ATU, a police in its stripe, has arrested three members of the new militant outfit from different parts of the country. The ATU members arrested Joel from Bagirhat, Rahul from Jaipurhat, and Ghazi ul Islam from the capital after conducting drives from September 13. Joel was the chief of the new outfit, while two others were the outfit's top leaders. DIG operations of ATU Abdul Alim Mahmud revealed this reporter at a press briefing at the ATU headquarters in the capital around 12, 12 p.m. today. The Holy Ide Miladun Nabi, marking the anniversary of the birth and demise of Prophet Hazrat Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, will be observed across the country on September 28 with due religious solemnity. The moon of Rabiul Awal of 1448. 45 Hijri was not sighted in the sky of Bangladesh on Friday. The holy month of Rabiul Awal will begin on September 17. The National Moon Sighting Committee took the decision at a meeting held at the Islamic Foundation IF conference room at Baitul Mukarram National Mosque on Friday evening. Secretary of the Ministry of Religious Affairs Muhammad Abdul Hamid Jamadar presided over the meeting. We're about to the end the headlines once again. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina is to leave for New Year tomorrow to attend the 78th United Nations General Assembly. Road march of BNP has begun which will end through the fall of the current government, says Mirza Fokrum. And six people, including children, were killed in road crashes in Narshindi in a span of four hours. That's all for now. To watch our news online, please visit YouTube slash MyTV News. To watch our old programs, please go to YouTube slash MyTV Bangla. Our next news bulletin will be telecast at 7.30 p.m. in Bangla. Stay tuned. Allah Hafiz.